Hello, my name is Okan Çelik and in this video we will take a quick look at the Q4 Polo's performance on a cast iron sample. So I first place my cast iron sample on the spark stand plate, then lower the clamp and press the start button with the green light around it. The red light around the stop button is turned on as soon as the system starts the analysis. You can also see all the sequences that the system goes through during the analysis on the lower right hand side of the screen. Let me start by giving some information about cast iron. Cast iron is an iron carbon alloy with a typical carbon content varying from roughly 2% to 4%. This iron alloy has been widely used by humanity for thousands of years to make various items such as plowshares, pots, cannons, bridges, and many more. Among the cast iron types are gray cast iron, white cast iron, malleable cast iron, and ductile or nodular cast iron like the one we are analyzing now. Ductile cast iron is also called nodular cast iron because carbon forms graphite in the form of small nodules, which makes the quantitative carbon analysis more difficult as the carbon distribution in the material is not homogeneous. But as you can already see on the analysis screen, this is not an issue for the Q4 Polo and it can precisely analyze the carbon together with other main alloying elements such as silicon, manganese, nickel, magnesium, chromium and phosphorus in cast iron. So in a few seconds we will have all the results on the analysis screen and if you have any questions about the Q4 Polo please visit our website and thank you for watching.